Welcome to Bottega Zero Waste. My name is Marta and this space is uh, for sharing recipes and tutorials on zero waste beauty um, as well as my personal zero waste journey. In today's video we're going to make a natural deodorant that really works. We're going to use really simple ingredients and a lot of these um, are also quite easy to find plastic free. I've also included in the description box below a link to my blog where I talk about how to get these ingredients unpackaged. We will only need 5 ingredients, coconut oil, arrowroot powder, baking soda and finally organic raw unrefined shea butter. To top up our deodorant we will add a mix of essential oils. First off, we will start by measuring 3 tablespoons of our root powder, which is the ingredient that will absorb any sweat to keep you dry. Um, of course, this is not an antiperspirant, it's a deodorant and there will still be a chance that you sweat, but that is natural and the root powder will definitely help a lot with that. We'll then add a half teaspoon of baking soda. I kept the measurements low so that it won't irritate your skin. And in another bowl, we will add one teaspoon of the coconut oil and one generous tablespoon um, of the shea butter. We will melt the oils in the microwave at uh, medium to high heat for about two minutes. But if you want, you can also melt them on a double boiler. Be careful, it will be quite hot, so make sure you use a cloth to protect your hands. We will transfer the powders in a bigger bowl so that we can easily add the melted butters and work through the mixture until they are fully incorporated and there are no clumps left. It's now time to add the essential oils. We will add about 5 drops of our grapefruit, lemon and tea tree essential oil. If you're adding only one type, then add up to 15 drops of essential oil. Once the essential oils are fully mixed in, we can gently pour the deodorant into our reusable metal tin. This is actually great because once we run out of our deodorant, we can simply wash and reuse the same tin. We will then need to let the deodorant solidify in the freezer for about one hour um, or if you want you can also leave it at room temperature to cool overnight. And this is the final result, the creamiest and most deliciously smelling all-natural deodorant. I've been using it myself for many many months and I really love it because it really does keep you dry and moisturized at the same time. Thank you so much for watching, I really hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you for the next recipe.